little more description and then we'll get started. There should be an enemy submarine in the deep sea. Even for you, there is a limit to how much water pressure you can handle. So if you try to find... I need to learn to read. So I will try to find you a route. Get in before the count in the upper right runs out. So yeah, even this deep in the water. Reploids can't handle the water pressure. And this is a maze. You definitely want to make sure you find your way through. And CL will be talking to you the entire time, but you kind of lose your signal as you go through. Now, in all honesty, I don't remember the path. It's pretty much just the luck of the draw, more or less. You want to find multiple pathways, though. Usually when you see Big Gap, you're pretty close to where you're going. Luckily, they give you a decent time limit to do everything, too. Like, don't be afraid to look around and explore. You can waste as many lives in this area as you need to. It always starts you back at the beginning of this area. Always trying to find the path here. And things can loop, so do be careful. Usually when CL pipes up, it either means you're running out of time, or you're close to where you're going. Which, I currently lost my location, and I'm running out of time. Help. Oops, ran right into him. Am I finding my way? There's some E-crystals. I hope I'm finding the right way. I think I have. I'm getting deeper. There we go. Alright, first try. Once you're in the sub, you're fine. Whew. Okay, and another mini boss. This one's probably gonna be ice type, so I'll need a fire attack. So, let's turn that on. That's the tractor shot, I want this one. Okay, flame fang, I know where to get, so I'll explain that one later. Whew. I'm probably gonna go quiet again on this guy. Jeez, that first shot's pretty handy. And they all have that laser tail. I don't know why. It is nice that they're different elements, though. Jerk. Make those go slower. Whew, that was cutting it close. And I wasn't fast enough there. Oh well. <sighs> there we go. That was easy. Okay. So, I guess I should explain it here. The burst shot you get from Miss Dragonfly and the flame thing, which is this attack, you get from the uh, heat golem guy. I forget. He's the turtle. I know he's, he's the, I know he's the turtle. I just forget his name. Anything up here? No. Now, this is an interesting section of the level. You're actually going around in a circle, and I like the concept they do for this. As you keep going, you'll see what I mean. Like, now we're actually seeing the bottom half down there. This was a neat concept in my eyes. It'd be perfect for a maze. And I am taking a beating. My rank's definitely gonna go down on this one. Bogo. And my nose is now running. Ow. Should have expected that. Just ignore them. We are good to go. And we're at the boss already. Yippee. Let's use a sub tank just for the heck of it. There we go. And down we go. Time to fight the boss. You're here. I've been waiting a long time for this, Zero. I'm not just one of the eight warriors. I am a remnant of the Zane army led by the late Phantom. I am Tech Kraken. I only put up with that while and this whole plan just so I could get revenge on the one who defeated Phantom. 
feel the rage of my former master. I will enjoy sinking these fangs of ice into you. And he fights us for honor. I always love coming across bosses like that. Oh. And because he's ice element, his weakness is fire. Which, all logic, doesn't make sense, but for fire to be working in the water, but he's pretty easy. Interesting. He didn't do his special attack. He'll actually um, dissolve into the darkness and attack you. I have lent my strength to while, and now I must pay. There is no way for me to save Phantom's soul. But I did what I had to do. Phantom, forgive me. Kind of killed my mood. Hmm, not bad. I took less damage than I thought I did. My rank's probably gone down though. No, what the? Jeez. <laughs> I'm not expecting to stay these high of rank. <sighs> so the boss of this area was one of Phantom's men. Phantom lost his life in one of our many battles. I sometimes wonder if all of our fighting is only creating more suffering in the world. Oh, Xiao. She's always so worried. I wonder if there's anything new we can create. I'm, oops, I didn't want to walk back out. Wrong button. <laughs> okay, now let's see. Anything? Holy crap, I got enough parts for these? I may as well make them. Perfect for a clear file, after all. Now try to collect as much as you can. And yeah, you need Ceratinum for a lot of things. For the junk armor and the S-Crystals, which S-Crystals are your best friend, trust me. Spike-type wind, this actually allows you to not be pushed back by the wind. If you can create this as soon as you can, I suggest you do it. And I guess I'll make another S-Crystal, and I still have enough for another one. Wow. I'll keep some of that serotanum. Maybe I'll try making the junk armor and see how that works. I can show it off after all. Now, if you talk to Alouette, she'd level up your Cyrelf some more. Of course, I'm max level, so... Don't be afraid to like go over max level if you need it either. It drops your Cyrelf score, but other than that, it's not too big of a deal. I think I had it around level... level... what level? I think I had it around level 5, maybe 6 at this time. So the closer you get to the end, the better. Uh, how much time do I have left? Not enough for another stage. So I guess I'll stop here. I'll make a save point. And let's just go over this one again. So. <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Mega Man 04. This is Autumn Child saying, I'll see you all next time. <laughs>